Well, if you're in this list of members, I want to find a member that deals with tree. The command to search for tree was entered on the command line. Getting the message that tree was not found was a surprise. A big surprise, since I know that one of these members contains the string tree. This video explains what is happening and how to correct it. Welcome. This is Dinosaur Parkour. Faster. Better. Mainframe programming. The string tree should be in a member named R08A. And there are three hits on the first 21 line. So that is a big what the heck is going on. Let's make sure I did not misspell the word tree. I have entered the command to invoke the retrieve panel. Number three shows that I did indeed spell tree correctly. Enter three to retrieve it from history. Ah, the casing is different. Maybe that is the problem. Back on the member list, we can try searching for tree using the same casing that was in the code. Whoa, still not found. Retrieve the prior command. Hmm, interesting. The entire command was converted to uppercase. Now it is time to try using a quoted strain. Surely the stuff inside the quote will not be folded to uppercase. The tree is in the quoted string and it is the same case as what was in the member. Press enter. <laughs> Still not found. Retrieve the prior command. Well, well. Even the stuff between the two tick marks were converted to uppercase. That presents a problem unless one coded completely in uppercase. 30 years ago, it was very rare to see lowercase in mainframe code. I mean, when email on PC started to become a thing, there was a system guy that typed every email using only uppercase. That's how he typed on the mainframe, and that's how he was going to type on the stupid toy computer. Nowadays, it is much more common to use Mitch case when coding program. And it is likely required if the program is using XML or JSON. It is time to enter search for on a command line without passing a parameter. That triggers search for to present a panel. The last search strain is shown in the search area. We're interested in the processing option, which are shown on the bottom third of the panel. Specifically, any case. The cursor is on the any case input field. Pressing PF1 yields the following help panel. When this option is toggled on, ISPF converts the lowercase letters into uppercase letters in memory before doing the search, thus making the search case insensitive. Cool. That is what we want because that part about search string being case sensitive is baloney when using the command line. We tried to make the search string case sensitive from the command line, and that does not work. If you need to do a case sensitive search, you can enter it on this panel, and it works. But who wants to do that? Invoking this panel each time would be a pain. It is better to turn on the case insensitive option. Now that uppercase search should work, both for this panel and from the command line. Press enter. I expected to find tree in the member R08A, but it's also in the member R09A, until I change it. That is how to make the ISPF search for command case insensitive. Happy searching and thank you for watching.